Hi guys, it's Rampant FM, and today we are looking at uh, basically the stats from season two, going into a preview of season three for our Kilmarnock career. For the top scorer in the Premier League was Barry Walker. He obviously got more games than George Hurst for the assists. Uh, Rory McKenzie obviously doing pretty well, and Angus Gunn was up there for clean sheets. Yeah, we had a really good season. Obviously, we were undefeated the whole year, which was fantastic. Uh, yeah, much better than season one. We kind of dominated the league. Celtic, obviously, and Rangers were sort of run us close, but yeah, we just ran away with it in the end. We have improved the team over the few years a lot. Yeah, um, obviously, we had our Europa League win as well, which was fantastic. We got put out of the Scottish Cup, so it could have it could have been a treble. We'll probably hope for that in season three. We'll look at some stats in the Euro League. I think Rory McKenzie and Chris Cadden were probably our two best players. So for this season, we have a big team. Um, we have to get rid of a few players. There's a lot of youth coming up as well. So yeah, a lot of the guys that maybe have not got a chance will probably likely leave. Uh, we did bring in Jack Grimmer and Ryan Christie. I'm not sure how many more transfers I'll bring. I'll, look to bring in to be honest but at the moment we have a really decent team yeah especially the goalkeepers uh, Stephen O'Donnell is probably likely to leave because of uh, Jack Grimmer's ar arrival it's a shame because he's done so well for us in this playthrough but I think it's time for him to move on now uh, Donald Love obviously he's kind of been a backup as well but and Jack Grimmer yeah, he's, pro he's probably going to be our main right back. As you'll notice, as I say, I'm not going to go too much detail because you can pretty much see on the screen. I wouldn't worry too much about uh, expired contracts. I am going to be renewing quite a lot of uh, a lot of the contracts. I've just not done it yet. And a lot of them seem to only have 12 months left. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to the season. I think um, especially Jamie McCart, he's probably gonna leave as well to be honest i think we're we're gonna try and bring in a, a bit better players not that we need them not that we really need them as much because we do have a decent team we obviously won the scottish league quite convincingly i think we can pretty much do it again uh so ryan says you know just a bit of a player but yeah as i said there's too many youth guys coming up this will be our last season it'll be interesting to see who we can what we can do with them basically but yeah, we do have our first teamers and obviously the guys that won't be leaving. Uh, we, oh yeah, I forgot we all we brought in Blair Spittle as well. I think he was a free from Partick, another class player. Likes of Scott Wright and Frank Ross, unfortunately, will probably believe they were kind of... Were they loaned out last season, I think? Yeah, so the, the, they just don't really have a future with us, unfortunately. They've not developed as much as I like. They've not been given a chance. All these sort of reasons in football that you would probably get led, rid of you know a fairly decent player but yeah we'll have to see how it goes um we're obviously looking to maybe do something a wee bit better in the champions league obviously try and win the scottish cup and the spl in our third season make sure it's like the best season we have we've obviously done pretty well ewan reed's doing really well casa dies obviously i think we're probably going to loan him out and then obviously got the likes of lewis mcleod uh, glenn middleton and Greg Kelly, they're, they're likely to all stay, I think, unless I can maybe secure loans for some of the guys that might not get much of a chance. But yeah, majority of these guys who have featured have been fantastic for us. But yeah, we just, Ryan Christie, obviously, uh, coming in, he will be a big player for us. Chris Cadden's obviously uh, our main right mid, but it's good to have competition at that level. Obviously, as I said, the youngsters like Barry Walker have done fantastic. Uh, Ewan Donaldson, another one. We'll just have to wait and see. I think our objective is just to have the best season possible going into season three. And there we are, Ewan Reid, who's came on fantastically. So that's the video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. We will do something a wee bit different. We're not going to be starting with a league game. We will come back for the European Super Cup against Manchester United. That'll be a very difficult game, but we obviously done well to win the Europa League. Thank you for all the support as always, I will see you soon.